going on, everybody? Howard Bender here from Fantasy Alarm. It's Monday, which means, that's right, Monday Night Football Monkey Knife Fight Prop Games. If you haven't been playing on Monkey Knife Fight, I really don't know what you're waiting for. We're making some money over there, and, well, with the holiday season coming up, isn't that what we need? A little extra cash? So jump on in here. Come to FantasyAlarm.com slash MKF. Use that promo code ALARM. And not only will you get a free $5 contest, but they're going to give you an instant deposit match up to $100. So get it on the action here, fantasyalarm.com slash MKF, and that promo code ALARM, again, $100 deposit match plus a free $5 contest. So let's get to the action tonight. We got the Giants against the Buccaneers in Tampa Bay. This one's fixing to be a fantastic game. Now, the Bucks are uh, three and six against the spread, which tonight seems to be a ten and a half point favorite for them. Uh, but they are three and one at home against the spread, so I feel like we're going to see some points in this one. I feel like we're going to see a lot of points in this one. So let's start it off here with our first contest, and that's more or less. And we're going to go with the quarterbacks like we always like to do, and let's talk passing yards here. Start off with Tom Brady. 295.5 passing yards. Well, in his four home games right now, Tom Brady uh, has not only thrown 18 touchdowns to just two interceptions, but he's averaged in those four games over 315 passing yards. So I like him for the more aspect here. You know it's prime time. It's a home game. It's Tommy Blue Eyes with all his weapons. You know he's going for over 300 tonight. The other one's Daniel Jones here, 238.5. Now, you know, in the last four or five games, Daniel Jones' passing numbers haven't really looked that good. But if you look at what happened at the start of the season, when he had his targets, when he was uh, the, the team was playing with Saquon Barkley, well, guess what? He was averaging over 245 passing yards per game there. I actually think he gets back on track. The best way to attack the Bucks is through the air. It's not on the ground. And uh, and while he will have Saquon Barkley back for this game, uh, keep in mind the Tampa Bay Buccaneers rank 26th in DVOA against running back pass plays, giving up an average of over 50 yards per game to them. So if the Giants are playing from behind, Daniel Jones is going to throw. He's going to go over this mark of 238.5. And, and he's going to help get, get the help from all of his weapons that he's going to need. So more for Daniel Jones as well. Second contest we're going with, how about the rapid fire? But listen, we're going to go a little deeper into the rapid fire. You know, usually we go against players and yards and stuff like that. Let's talk fantasy points because we can actually get a 3.5 uh, X on our return if we get both of these right. So we'll start off with the quarterbacks here. Tom Brady versus Daniel Jones. Fantasy points totals? Well, like I just said, Tom Brady averaging over 310, 315 passing yards per game. 18 touchdowns in four games at home? Come on. Him versus Daniel Jones? And Daniel Jones is getting only four and a half fantasy points? Well, I know that can translate to a little more than 100 yards, but it's going to be about the touchdowns here. And I think Tommy Blue Eyes has him covered. So Brady on the rapid fire here over Jones plus four and a half fantasy points. The other one is Chris Godwin versus Mike Evans. So, you know, you never really know which receiver is going to be the one who's going to get the bulk of the targets, who's going to end up in the end zone because Tom Brady loves to, to throw it around and spread it around to all of his different receivers. But I think, listen, Godwin matches up real, real nice here against Darnay Holmes, their slot corner for the Giants. Uh, he's lining up in the slot over 65% of the time, so he's going to have that matchup exposed throughout this entire game. So give me Godwin over Evans. They're giving Evans only .5 fantasy points here. So, what, 50 yards receiving? Nah, not, not gonna, I mean, it's 5 yards receiving. Do the math. <laughs> All right, so give me Chris Godwin over Mike Evans here by point f more than point five, and give me Tom Brady over Daniel Jones with four and a half points there. And then finally here, our last game. You know it. I love it. It's the touchdown dance, baby. I wish Monkey Knife Fight would let us just 
load up on one team, but you got to pick three guys and only they have to be from each team. So two from one, one from the other. Where are we going to go? Well, I'm going Rob Gronkowski because he is playing for the first time in, what, six games? And you know primetime games are Gronk's thing. Brady's going to hit Gronk. He could hit Gronk for two touchdowns in this one here. The Giants against the tight end, really not that great. But we're going to play it safe. We're going Gronk. I'm going to go Leonard Fournette because the Giants rank 30th in the uh, in DVOA against the run. All right, so give me some Fournette. We're going to see him get his. Uh, and then on the Giants side here, I'm just going to go with Kadarius Toney. You know, I think as a slot receiver here for the Giants, it's a decent matchup for him. We've seen him get peppered with targets. There's no Sterling Shepard, so this is going to be a lot of Tony because I just can't rely on Kenny Galladay or, or Darius Slayton for that matter. So Kadarius Tony, we'll let him be the guy who's going to get into the end zone. If you want to pivot off of Tony, you can go with Evan Engram, tight end for the Giants. He has caught a touchdown in each of the last two games. I'm going to go with Tony here because you know I think it's actually irrelevant because I think Fournette and Gronk are each going to get a touchdown, and we're just going in for the nice, easy money here. I'm going to double our investment and just say two touchdowns amongst these three guys. So there you go. More or less, rapid fire, and the touchdown dance. Enjoy winning on some Monday Night Football. Enjoy getting the uh, little extra money here for the holiday season. Again, fantasyalarm.com slash MKF gets you a free $5 contest plus hundred dollar match on your first deposit i'm howard bender of the fantasy alarm we'll catch you next time